So then with, let's go into side bending, because it's pretty similar. Okay. So again, bend them up. So with side bending. You have the table taller or lower for a second. I mean, depending on your biomechanics, depending if you're in your practice. <laughs> <laughs> so, so yes, so I, I ideally want to have good mechanics. Um, so with, with side bending, you're not in between the spinous process, you're more towards you, okay, so your proximal side. Okay, and so again, find iliac crest, come across. Okay. So you're going in between, not in between, off to the side. And what you should feel when you're lifting, okay, so the motion is here. So I'm lifting them and I'm bending them here, okay. What you're feeling for is L5, the, the most um, caudal segment, should come into your finger. Okay, that, that's when you know that, that one's kind of locked out. Work your way up, L4 should come into your finger, work your way up, okay. So here, so again, same kind of hold. Now instead of having him on my front leg, he's kind of on my back, okay? And I kind of treat his legs like an air guitar, <laughs> okay? So I'm here, and all I'm doing is body mechanic-wise, I'm just shifting my weight back, okay? 